see my hair is very short. My hair has never grown past um, my chest. It's never ever grown. This is a little bit shorter, but I'll show you the back and the thinness. I just have no bleaching it and um, all the damage is just, you can see I have like, what's it called? Um, like a man. <laughs> I don't know. Like how their hair, like, I feel like it's balding, but I see the baby hairs. My hair is just so thin. I hope you can tell through this video. That's my makeup routine. I have always used drugstore makeup. I've never bought nice things until I started um, working more and I could afford it. So my first purchase was this. This smells exactly like chocolate. It's amazing. And I absolutely love, love. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Bought this too. I get super oily um, after my makeup. This is really annoying. The third thing I bought, this was all at Ulta, was this. And so, um, if you can tell what that is, it's Born This Way Too Faced Natural Radiant Concealer. And I'll get my base is CoverGirl. It's nothing. I just throw a lot on. So I start with my Photo Finish Foundation Primer. It's pore minimizing. And my review on this is I really don't notice a difference. But I always thought primer was weird. I'm like, why would you put something that's like liquid on your face if you're oiled? <laughs> stupid but this it comes so these are other problem areas but um this it comes off like a mousse and then it come then you grab it like rub it in and um it's like a powder it goes into a powder so the texture changes and it's it's really really cool My voice is super annoying and I have to talk quiet because my roommate's sleeping. <laughs> it's not full coverage like it says. Like when I um, wear makeup, I go all out and I want everything. Everything covered translucent powder at Sally's like beautiful I absolutely love this it's a beautiful finish very matte no seriously it is amazing translucent powder is wonderful you can use it for everything everyday looks and you will look flawless so I always go up into the hairline and I always go on my neck because I had a spray tan so this matches my tan, but I'm white <laughs> right now, my, my tan faded. So I do not want a makeup line. And people, when they see me do this, they're like, like my friends, Kaylee Byrne, <laughs> she thinks it's the weirdest thing ever. And I do on my lips because I do the Kylie Jenner thing where I do not put, I put lipstick like not even on my lips to make them bigger. So my lips are a pretty good size, but like it's, um, I like that, I like the big lips and so um, that's why I love makeup because I can do really big lips and you know get what you weren't given. My most favorite of all time product. And, and, and doing makeup is concealer because conceal I have really bad 
um, circles. Always have my grandma and dad got it from them. Thanks, mom, dad, and grandma. This is my roommate's. I definitely stole it. Um, Wet and Wild. So I love this. The only thing I do not love about, I just got my makeup out of my car so it's cold and this is really thick so it's not gonna come out. But um, I love this, but the only thing I don't love is um, like the lines underneath your eyes. It, it goes like into them, it doesn't cover them. So you can see the wrinkles under your eyes. You use translucent powder and then um, I dab it once I see that and um, usually it's pretty good about going away. That's the only thing is like it shows the wrinkles. So I'm going to do my eyebrows because that is frozen. My eyebrows are like non-existent because I waxed them off one too many times many times so I am using the elf eyebrow kit I got it off of Amazon I think for six dollars um, I really like it <laughs> I'm not one of those girls that can do like the thick shaped eyebrows because my face is just not like that. My eyebrows aren't like that at all naturally. Um, so I just work with what I got and if I do it thicker it just looks weird. <laughs> it looks weird. And then I take this, which is um old, an old mascara, and I only do mine right there because if I do it on the ends, it'll just wipe it off. It'll disappear. This, this is to get the eyebrow hairs like separated, so it's not like those girls that the eyebrows completely solid. Like that looks so terrible, and my eyebrows definitely aren't the best, but. I watched a lot of YouTube to YouTube tutorials in my day on eyebrows and my friend, my best friend eyebrows are perfect. Oh, I love concealer. It just makes your face bright and happy. So my hair is like an ombre, so this is the wig I use. Um, really dark at the roots, to medium to really blonde. So I kind of like my hair just a million times better. I bought this wig leave-in spray. Um, and I spray it on the ends especially. This. So beautiful, wonderful. This wig has two clips right there. 
Um, this one went weird. I have a bobby pin there because it um, did not stay at all. Kind of went out on it. And then it has one at the bottom. And these to tighten it. And pretty sure that the this works for me. Just adjust it to yours. So what I do is I hold it like this. I do the bottom one first and then I put it the, right there and then I do those right there so then I do the bottom one officially Pull it down and then I do my hair like that. So that's my real hair, that's the fake hair. And then what I do is I So I take eyeshadow to it. So I'm gonna go for it. I'm going to blend it. 